use a unit fraction with either conversion to convert the units round to the hundredths place value. We are given one ounce is approximately 28.350 grams and one gram is approximately 0.0353 ounces. We will show both conversions in this video. In the first example, we're asked to convert 12 ounces to grams. The first step is to write 12 ounces as a fraction with the denominator of one. To perform the conversion, we will multiply by a unit fraction. The important thing to recognize here is that because we have ounces in the numerator and we want ounces to simplify out, for the unit fraction, the ounces must be in the denominator and therefore the grams must be in the numerator. Now using the first conversion of one ounce is approximately 28.350 grams. One possible unit fraction is 28.350 grams over one ounce. Using the conversion of one gram is approximately 0.0353 ounces. Another possible unit fraction would be one gram over 0.0353 ounces. Before multiplying, notice how in both cases we have ounces divided by ounces, and therefore the units of ounces simplify out, leaving us with grams. And now let's determine the products. Multiplying here, notice how we have a denominator of one, and therefore the product is just 12 times 28.350, and the units are now grams. Here we have 12 divided by 0.0353, and again, the units are grams. And now let's go to the calculator and determine this product as well as the quotient. And again, we are told to round to the hundredths place value or two decimal places. Notice how the product is 340.2 grams and the quotient is 339.94 grams, running to the hundredths place value. Notice there is a slight difference because these conversions are approximations. but the homework system will take either conversion. I'm gonna go ahead and enter approximately 340.2 grams. And now we want to convert 320 grams to ounces. And again, let's show both conversions. We first write 320 grams as a fraction with the denominator of one. And now we multiply by a unit fraction to perform the conversion. But in this case, because we want grams to simplify out, and we have grams in the numerator here, grams must be in the denominator of the unit fraction, and therefore ounces will be in the numerator. Using the first conversion of one ounce is approximately 28.350 grams. One possible unit fraction is one ounce over 28.350 grams. Using the second conversion, a possible unit fraction would be 0.03 five, three ounces over one gram. And now before multiplying, notice how in both cases we have grams divided by grams, and therefore the units of grams simplify out, leaving us with ounces. In this first product, we have 320 divided by 28.350 ounces. And in the second product, we have 320 times 0.0353 ounces. And now let's go back to the calculator. Rounding to the hundredths place value, notice how the quotient is approximately 11.29 ounces because we have a seven in the third decimal place, we round up. And then for the product, because we have a six in the third decimal place, we round up. Because we have a nine to the left, this rounds to 11.30. So we have approximately 11.29 ounces and 11.30 ounces. And again, the system will accept either conversion. I'm gonna go ahead and enter 11.29 ounces. I hope you found this helpful.